There is one organ which causes high blood pressure, and it's not what you think. And there are specific exercises you can use to target and fix your blood pressure easily. No diet, lifestyle changes, or medication required. Check the link in the description below. But for now, today's question. The question, what does a low systolic and a high diastolic blood pressure reading indicate? This is called a narrowing pulse pressure. Everyone else failed to mention what it indicates, and it can mean several things. Another answerer mentioned that the decreased systolic blood pressure is due to decreased ejection of blood from the left ventricle, but not what causes it. Typically, a narrowing pulse pressure is caused by some sort of obstruction or congestion of the heart, such as congestive heart failure, aortic stenosis or pericardial tamponade. These conditions put pressure or some sort of obstruction, such as a valvular stenosis, on the left ventricle, or the entire heart, in some way or another that prevents the heart from pumping effectively and emptying its chambers completely. Cardiogenic shock that's caused by one or more of these conditions is categorized as obstructive shock, in case anyone has a cardiology exam coming up, for the reasons mentioned above. Additional forms of obstructive shock include pulmonary embolism, tension pneumothorax, and pericarditis, which constricts the heart similarly to pericardial tamponade. The diastolic pressure remains normal or elevated because there is continuous blood remaining in the left ventricle after each contraction. Hope this clears things up.